high school, good humor They say I'm out of my mind Standing on the outside But it's cooler, it's fresher I like it here There are so many benefits to just getting away and recharging And one of the things that you can do while being in a quiet place where you can think is journaling. You know, as I sit here in the room overlooking the balcony, looking out into nature, starting off journaling first thing in the morning just gives me a clearer mind, less anxiety, and room for better creativity. You know, it's similar to fasting. You know, you your body has to go through a place where um, it fasts from food and it gives it the space to recover. And if your body needs that space to recover as far as your stomach, imagine the countless benefits from journaling. Now, there's one or two ways that you can do your journaling. One of them would be immediately when you first wake up in the morning, writing down your gratitudes, writing down uh, your affirmations and just things that you uh, want to achieve in the day another way of journaling is just disconnecting so being able to drive maybe to the nearest park or drive 30 minutes away from the environment that you have and being in that quiet space and just disconnecting and then in that place it's like a self-reflection a self inventory you can be more grateful how far you've come and the benefits of where you are now in that place of journaling and reflecting the next step is being completely honest with yourself no hiding no shaming just writing exactly what it is Another part of journaling that I feel has helped is having a designated page, maybe another book, or even a poster to just write down all the things that you want to attract, whether a healthy relationship with a family member, having a baby, purchasing a new car, you know, all those things that you want to attract, the things that you love, desire, feel that you need or want. Having that written down. And finally, the best part I love about journaling, it doesn't have to be perfect. Your randomness, your desires, your plans, your visions all become one of journaling. You know, some of you might call it, you know, law of attraction. Others might call it, um the Habakkuk dream to write the vision and make it plain and that's exactly what it is journaling it's a place to be vulnerable it's a space to be open to give you some clear direction better creativity and less anxiety for the rest of your day or right before you go to bed video and don't forget that having that me time is really important because if you are trying to get to other people you must first fill into yourself because we all know you can't pour from an empty glass so don't forget to take time for yourself whether it's through journaling whether it's through walking through the park going to the ocean like how I am right now just by the water and just taking it all in being one with nature all right so question of the day where do you all go when you want to get alone and have you time and putting yourself first. This video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button, the subscribe button right here. And don't forget to check out my video. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.